Beautiful gifts are easy to find and justify at Mango and May Boutique in Annapolis. We partner with groups in Africa, Haiti, India, Peru. So everything has a bigger purpose and a story behind it. And owner Shannon Reisenfeld says sales have come and gone throughout the pandemic, holidays especially. Whenever um, there's good news, um, whenever people are feeling more hopeful and optimistic, people were really excited and they were out spending more. According to the National Retail Federation, retail sales were up more than 15 percent compared to the same time in 2020. It's exactly why financial expert Sue Rogan says impulse spending can get tricky. What we see a lot of is around the holidays or people's um, special events in their lives. They tend to be like, well, I deserve this. I need this. I want this. And so sometimes we let the guard down a little bit around our dollars and just kind of let them flow out. So of course you want to shop small. You want to support your local businesses. But Rogan says it's all about balance by first taking a look at your budget. It's really important to put in your spending plan some money, whether it's for fun or some money for buying those things that you really want. Rogan says understanding the external and internal factors behind why you buy helps. She also recommends buy one thing throw another out or take the time to think as much as six months before you buy. What is it that I can spend that makes me feel I'm in control of my dollars? Control can also come with some help, including the nonprofit cash campaign of Maryland. All plan financial success through the pandemic. In Annapolis, Amy Lou, WBAL TV 11 News.